Every year we celebrate Father's Day, acknowledging the role dads play in their kids' lives. In tonight's Education Matters, Juanita Stevenson joins us with how Fresno Unified is harnessing the power of fathers to improve student achievement. Juanita. Well, recent figures show that African American students in Fresno Unified are not achieving the way they should be. District officials hope that getting more fathers involved can help bridge the achievement gap. There you go. That's a good job. 32 year old Anthony Trice sits at a table helping students with their work. Good job. Almost done all the way around. He knows just how to talk to them and encourage them. Trice was at Powers Ginsburg Elementary School to support his six year old son, as well as any other kid who happened to be sitting at that table. There we go. Trice knows the difference his support and participation can make. Growing up, I didn't have a lot of support in school. Um, so I try to make sure my kids have 100% support in everything they're doing. Parents like Mr. Trice were celebrated during a recent Father's Day event held at 18 elementary schools in the Fresno Unified School District. The event was sponsored by the district's new Office of African American Academic Acceleration. Parent engagement equals academic engagement. And we're looking for ways to get our kids more motivated um, and also help parents engage better. This event was held in partnership with United Black Men of Fresno. The organization is working to encourage more African American men to take leadership roles in their community and children's lives. It's all a part of a, uh, a broader event of transforming uh, our kids and our community because African American children are failing completely. The numbers aren't good. Only 20% of African American students in Fresno Unified are proficient in English, 12% proficient in math. We need parents to uh, advocate on behalf of their kids. We need parents to visit the school and establish relationships with parent, with other parents and teachers and administrators and really encourage their kids and understand what their experiences are at school. If you want to know the difference being there can make, listen to Salvador Hernandez talk about his stepdad. When he comes, I see him, he makes me like do more things that I don't random, that I don't usually do at school. Like, I, I do my work fast, I'm all happy with a big smile on my face. That's why Ruben Cabrera wasn't going to miss this Father's Day event. He went to work early that morning at 3 a.m. so he could take off to be at his stepson's school. It was worth it. Once I walked through the door, he was seeing me and he was like, his smile was just like happy. And I felt that that's what he needed. So I kind of like, I was enjoying myself just to be here with him. And just that smile makes, makes a big difference. Oh, really warms that, your heart. That is so it? heartwarming. <laughs> well, the, the uh, office and the district, they're planning more events to involve more fathers, including a summer reading program where they're going to teach the dads how to teach their kids how to read. Fantastic. Are they finding yeah. that it's something about specifically having men there, fathers working, well, even know, if it's not your own dad, but having, having it's an adult always man there? Been so, having an adult role model or figure consistently, yeah. really. Can make a huge impact. And, and I think it's the, just the bottom line based on my own experience of volunteering in classrooms. I'm sure you did that too, Juanita. Yeah. The, the kids are so proud when their parents come yes. in. Oh, you may not think they are, you know, you may not think that it really matters, but boy, do they, uh, they are so happy to have yes. you there. Yeah. Yes. That's neat. I'm looking forward to them doing that more and more and more, right? Yeah. Juanita, thanks. Appreciate it.